All right, so we're on to other biases. I'm gonna combine these two into one video because they're kind of the same, a little different, but kind of the same. That is the like what we got effect in the illusory superiority. So like what we got effect is this fake place where all the kids, all the children are better than average. Um, illusory superiority effect is individuals overestimate their own qualities and abilities relative to others. This can take um, a wide array of areas like intelligence, performance, uh, performance on tasks, um, tests, how well you do on tests. Uh, like what we got effect is a natural tendency to overestimate one's capabilities and see oneself as better than others. And we do this all the time. Um, sort of goes into the overconfidence effect a little bit but they're a little bit different as well. The like what we got effect is usually what I call it by. Illusion superiority is another one. Um, every time I look it up, there's always two different things. They don't just combine the two when I think they're pretty much the same. So what can we take from this? We, again, we're always looking at the world and we're always placing ourselves higher up which isn't a good way to do things. And that's one of the big takeaways from a lot of biases. There's a, quite a few that are kind of the same, a little bit different. Um, but with these two, I find very interesting, especially the Lake Wobegon effect, because that's what I first learned it as, as the Lake Wobegon effect. I was watching um, Yale lectures by Paul Bloom, who, who's fantastic, fantastic teacher, very smart, smart guy. He's got quite a few good lectures out there. He's got a um, book uh, Descartes' Baby um, Against Empathy is uh, one he kind of got a little heat for, but it's actually very interesting. But like I said, it's a natural tendency to overestimate one's capabilities and see oneself as better than others. Just superiority is kind of the same way. And I mean, we, we do that all the time. We, we always perceive ourselves as, you know, better. And we got to, you know, put this sort of mental cognitive image in our mind to change to be like all right that's something that everybody has but i can try to block that out i can try to compensate for that now is it going to be 100 percent compensation probably not but you know knowing of it is step one step one in, in the process of getting better having a better understanding of the situation or your lot in reality so yeah, those are two ones that I find pretty interesting. I just put them together because if I made a video on each one, it would probably be just be the same thing. So I thought of combining those two. So looking at those two in the pool of all the other ones, you can kind of start getting a realization of what's going on. But yeah, that is the like what we got effect in the illusory um, superiority. I don't think there's anything else I want to add on those two topics but yeah i mean this can go into a variety of any situations you know i'm a better student i'm better blah 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 um but most likely you're not um but yeah uh, thank you very much